So the question says, two identical boats, each with mass of 110 kilograms, rest on a pole. A person with mass 60 kilograms sat in boat one. So we have two identical boats. Sitting in a pool of water, right? And you have a person here jumping from one boat to the other. Okay? And after the person jumped from boat one to boat two, the, the speed of boat one was 0 0.03. 3 meters per second. Now, they want us to find the speed of boat 2 after the person has jumped from boat 1 to boat 2. Right? So, this is clearly a momentum equation. Right? So, you want, to write, you want to write down what the initial momentum of the system would be and the final momentum would be. Now, clearly, the initial momentum of the system where everything is at rest would be 0. Right? And initial momentum is equal to final momentum. Okay? Now, initial momentum of the system before the person has jumped is zero. The final momentum can be written as momentum of boat 1 system plus momentum of boat 2 system. Right? Now, the boat 2 system now contains the map because he's jumped boat from boat 1 to boat 2. Now, having done that, we plug in the values so we get mass of the boat, which is 110 times 0 0.03 which is the speed with which the boat is moving now note this is negative x this is positive x right. plus the mass of the boat plus mass of the man times the speed of the boat which is what the unknown is here right and in solving that, we get the velocity of the boat is 0.19 meters per second. Okay, so let's do a recap. So what happened was there was a man here on the first boat, and he jumped from the first boat to the second boat. Initially, both the boats were at rest. Then, when the man started moving, jumped, the first boat started moving in this direction, and the second boat moved in that direction. Okay, so we wrote that since there is no external force to the system, and initial momentum is equal to final momentum. Initial momentum was zero because there was nothing moving, and final momentum is momentum of boat one system plus boat two system. We noted that the boat two system consists of the man and the boat, both moving at B in that direction, the boat 1 system consists of the boat moving at 0.3 meters per second in the reverse direction. Resultantly, we found the velocity of the boat.